December the 13th, 2021. Guys, you're looking at the uh, USG earthquake information coming in tonight. And there's a very large quake that happened here. I think it came in as a 7.8, and now they've downgraded it to a 7.3, 18.4 kilometers deep. But this is uh, 120 kilometers north of Mawamir, Indonesia. Very dangerous area. You remember when we had a quake, uh, was it 2004? We lost about 300,000 people on the uh, what we call the Banda Aci quake. Remember that? Very dangerous area. But what they're saying about this is there's no tsunami warning. It's a very powerful quake, and some of these areas are very shallow. I just want to look at one of the buoys here, and so you can kind of make up your mind for yourself if you want to pay attention to this if you're in this area. This is north of Australia and south of some of the Indonesian islands. And if you switch over to the tsunami information, usually it's pretty correct. Uh, it says no tsunami warning advisory watch or threat. And it's giving the location here that we just saw in the earthquake. But I want to look at one of the uh, offshore buoys, guys. And what this buoy is showing, again, this is station 56001, water column height, is about a 25-meter sudden rise you've got a 5,090 meters this is 51,010 meters if you went straight through there that would be 20 meters which would be 60 feet now you add about another uh, five meters to that so guys you're at 75 foot a sudden raise in the um uh, where this buoy is located as far as the depth check that out so again, they're saying no tsunami warning, and I don't know how to tie that in with this information, but if I was there, I'd be very careful. We're seeing a lot of changes coming on this planet, guys, but again, I want to keep this one quick. If you're in the Indonesian area or you're south of there in the northern Australia area, just keep your eyes open. Again, 65, 70-foot wave or draw a change in height of uh, where the buoy is is nothing to uh, downplay it's a heads up be safe